We help authors with the better way possible. Huawei has changed the way I see technology. We can make change happen. My name is Pedro Gabriel. I'm 23 years old. Uh, I'm from São Paulo, Brazil. I've been living here my whole life, uh, ever since I was a little kid. I like to play soccer. When I started the Seeds for the Future program, I didn't know about Tech for Good project. And it was a really great experience. When I was there with my friends, with my group, I really thought that we made a great team. We found out that that was a relevant problem here in Brazil. That was a, a real thing that was affecting a lot of people and especially in the water system. In order to provide water for those who need, we thought about uh, a sensor that will be on the water tank, can measure the level of the water. And then the sensor can send this information to the water truck drivers. They will be able to see who will be with shutters of water. We were uh, thinking about it at the time that this project could really help those people. In Libya, there are more important things to care about than basketball or football. Life, the health of babies. As you know, it's a tough land. But children are the seeds of this land. Our project is called Smart in ICU, Smart Neonatal Intensive Care Unit to save those little bodies suffering lots of pain, so that they get timely treatment. In the future, it can also be applied to other medical fields. For example, the data can be analyzed to predict diseases in advance and enhance the health of more people. In the first phase of the competition, we were named as the best team, and from then on, we started sharing our project on social media. Huawei is a good teacher, teaching us how to manage a team and how to work as a team. In Tunisia, Huawei provided great mentors and instructors, and an even greater vacation. Huawei has changed the way I see technology. Technology can be used to serve humanity and society for very pure purposes. Have we started yet? Yes. Okay. We wanted to share the traffic condition. I was stuck in traffic jam when it was raining heavily. I saw an ambulance also stuck there. So we thought if we could solve the problem of the traffic jam to allow the ambulance to pass quickly, it could bring hope to the patient. Although the process was tough, but it's very rewarding to us. Many people give us favorable comments and hope that the project we are doing will bring the positive change to the local traffic. Everyone in this team gained a lot from this project. Someone found a girl he liked, someone got an honor from a university, someone got an offer from Hawaii, but I got this. The most important thing we got from this project is determination. The determination to keep doing this project in Thailand. With one second, you can save life. With one second, you can avoid losing the loved one. That's the purpose of doing this project. Technology can be used to benefit society and author. Not just only to make money, but to care for author. This is a very good thing. Hi everyone! As you can see, I physically challenged myself. And this is my mother, who also has hearing and speaking difficulties. For us, what we need more than deliberate and excessive care in society is equality. Everyone has different views on equality, but I think material things are always the foundation. So we want to use technology to promote employment for the physical challenge and make it easier for them to find jobs. Through social media, many people have learned about the project and they share it with parents who have deaf children, telling them that the app is very user-friendly and interactive. And of course, my mom is the most enthusiastic promoter. Because my mom is deaf, from the beginning, I wanted to make the main model for this app capable of detecting hand gestures. But at a technical level, it needed to be supported by a lot of sign language data. There was no other shortcut. We had to enter Vietnamese sign language data one by one. Just as our model was able to work properly. Now, the app is not only helps people with disability to find jobs, but also make it easier for me to communicate with my mother. Living under the same sky, I hope that we can all try to change and live for the better life. 